How do you know when to see your doctor? Well, gee, funny you should ask. We just happen to have some of the warning signs, and this will give you a good idea. Doctor, I would guess all of these are, are pretty simple. You got Absolutely. these problems, go. Absolutely. Uh, sudden severe pain in the low back or leg that's, so, that's telling you that you already have a, something, an injury going on. So any, the, the, how the body is going to react will be by signaling that you have pain. So that's the way that it's going to alarm you that you have something going on in your body and that that's our mechanism of, of protection. So that will make you seek attention. Uh, obviously, if there's a violent injury like a fall or a trauma, normally one of the things that we want to make sure that there's no, no fractures on the spine. So at least if you have those, at least go to the physician or urgent care or ER, making sure at least get some x-rays. Um, if there's a fracture, definitely we can treat those. Um, if it's not, then most likely it's a, it's a muscle contusion and you, you can uh, rest free. It's just a matter of time. And then obviously trouble controlling bowel bladder, that means that you have significant compression of the lower segments of the lower back. And, and basically that's compressing the, the last of the nerves. And that means that you have a significant amount of, uh, of, of nerve compression. Why do you use leg raises? to help do some of the diagnosis? Uh, the straight leg raising uh, is, a, is a test that we use on, on or it's, it's a maneuver that you, we use on, on physical examination that we, we lift the leg up. So we have someone lying down and all of a sudden we lift the leg up. So what happens is that we're putting some stress or some strain on the lower segments, mostly the, and it goes, the, 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 the lower the number, the more strain you put. So you, we have the S1 nerve, the L5 nerve, the L4 nerve. Those are, those are the ones that we're testing. The S1 nerve gets most of the torque when you're doing that, so it's more sensitive for an S1 problem rather than an L5, rather than an L4. So what that means, we have the, the, the nerve, so they, they have a number. We call them by a lumbar. S1, sacral 1, L5, lumbar 5, lumbar 4, etc. So the more torque, more, strength, more strain we're putting on those nerves, uh, when we're lifting the leg up, um, that's telling us if you have something going on in the spine, but we, it's not specific. We don't know what's causing you the symptoms. We know that there's something going on.